Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you how to diagnose your ignition coils on your Johnson Evinrude uh, outboard motors. So this is for a 1996 Evinrude 200 horse and it's got six cylinders, got six coils. So I'm going to show you how to test it. I got in the manual here, it shows me what readings I need. It says the one test we do is universal on all models, but I'm going to show you how to test at least this horsepower. So there's two tests you want to do. You're going to need an ohm meter. And the first test, we're going to check the primary coil, the small, the one that the small wire boot goes onto, and this the ground of the engine. So we're going to hook this up to the ground, and we're going to test test this primary coil. And the primary coil should have between 0.5 to 1.5 ohms. So that's reading in within range. Now we're going to test the secondary coil, and that's just between the two plugs here. This reading should be 225 to 325 ohms. So this coil is good. It's an old coil, and a lot of times you can get them as a kit, aftermarket ones. And I might end up just getting all new ones. But this is... This is one that was bad. Let's see what it looks like. So the primary coil is within range. But the secondary coil is a little out of range. It was showing a lot higher than that earlier but it's still without still outside of the range bracket so this one is bad and that's how you test your ignition coils hope this helps